New at 530, police call to the same homes multiple times a week. They're frustrated, and the mayor says it's time for it to stop. So Latrobe is ready to force landlords to make sure their tenants behave. Yeah, if they don't, those landlords could end up being fined. Here's Westmoreland County Bureau Chief Ross Gadotti. In Latrobe, when it comes to repeated calls to 911 for police service, there are few places that match this apartment building on Main Street. Three, four times a night to the same resident, five, six times a week. Uh, and it, it, it's frustrating to the, the police. That's why the city is now considering a new ordinance which calls for landlords to be held more accountable for just who they rent to, or as Latrobe's police chief puts it. We've been here so many times. How about taking care of the problem so we don't have to take care of the problem any further? The calls for service always vary. Disturbance calls, violent calls, and drug and alcohol related calls. But Latrobe police say it's not just this apartment building causing all the issues. It's all over. And according to the city, the nuisance locations are nearly always rental properties with a certain type of ownership. It's the absentee landlords that, that tend to that we tend to have issues with. Details are still being hammered out, but if adopted, the statute calls for face-to-face -face meetings with the problem property owners to address the issues and try to find a solution. But if the landlord is unwilling to work with us or doesn't call us back or, you know, isn't willing to do anything, then there's fines associated with it. The amounts of such fines are still being worked out, but city leaders say they will be significant enough to compel correction. With all that said, however, police in Latrobe want to make one thing clear. This is not to discourage victims of a crime for calling for help. While this statute is still being crafted, the mayor hopes to get it in front of city council and possibly see approval of it sometime early next year. In Latrobe, Ross Gadotti, KDKA TV News.